Hey, welcome and welcome back to my channel, Dash of Lux. Here we talk about all things fashion, luxury, handbags, beauty related, and just anything that makes us as women feel beautiful. Today I just wanted to chat with you about fall fashion. So I've been seeing a lot of information about what's trending, what's out this fall, what we should and shouldn't be wearing, and I'm starting to feel a little bit overwhelmed. So I just wanted to like go back to basics, not do a lot of shopping, shop my closet, be creative, put some things together that look really cute, and maybe provide some outfit inspiration for myself and for you. So if that's something you're interested in, then keep watching. So listen, I'm not one of the fashion girls. I don't claim to know everything there is to know about the fashion world and what's trending and designers and you know all of the runway shows, all of that crap, but I am a girl that loves fashion and I love being creative and putting outfits together and figuring out how I want to show up in the world on a particular day. So I'm not exactly sure how this video is going to go. I think what we're going to do is we're just going to play in my closet, basically. But I have picked up a few pieces that I've had my eye on that fit into my personal style. A couple of things have been on my wish list because they've piqued my interest over the last couple of months. So we're just going to like try things on, put outfits together basically play in my closet as if you were here with me and we're finding outfit inspiration together okay for this first look first of all i'm wearing this green kind of cable knit sweater and this color this olive green sage color is trending for fall right now and it just happens to be one of my favorite colors so this sweater is something that I picked up at Nordstrom Rack. It was very inexpensive, maybe like $24 or something. So I just, this is what I've been wearing for the video. So I just threw on this cropped trench coat jacket and can we just get into this? This is so cute. Honestly, this is one of the trends that I wasn't sure about um, participating in but I decided to give it a try and I ordered it off of Nordstrom and I really like it so I can see myself wearing this with like maybe like a white button-down shirt underneath maybe peeking out underneath it um, and I'm wearing it with these wide leg distressed denim jeans and these are by AG and these red Steve Madden pointy toe shoes these are actually a Ghani dupe and I love them. They're just so comfortable and of course they're like a third of the price. Okay, for this next outfit, I just threw on this sweatshirt that I got from H&M. It says Champs Elysees, Paris 1970 and this is so cute. Burgundy is trending this fall so it has that burgundy handwriting. And the lipstick that I'm wearing is like a burgundy type lipstick and it's Rebel by MAC and it's like the perfect fall winter lipstick. I love it. And then I just paired it with the same AG jeans. I bought these from Nordstrom and a pair of Sam Edelman silver shoes. But I can also wear, now that I think about it, I can also wear these, uh, burgundy lug boots with this outfit and it would look just as nice especially since burgundy is trending for fall so um, this outfit I purchased the sweatshirt and the jeans this season and the shoes are totally out of my closet okay so for this next outfit we are playing into that burgundy color trending this fall as well as plaid so i'm not exactly sure about this outfit but we'll go through it together and just tell me what you think about it so i have on this burgundy uh turtleneck it's kind of like a mock turtleneck and this uh little uh plaid mini skirt and then the burgundy tights and the burgundy um lug boots 
this is actually like a squirt but it's a little too, I think for my mature age, it might be a little too short for me. I don't think this is something that I would probably wear, but I think it's cute if this is your style, if you um, are someone that wears like mini skirts with tights, but I'll put up the inspiration picture from Pinterest that I was trying to um, imitate. I'm not sure that, you know, it looked different in my mind. I'm not sure that I would wear this, but I think it's cute for maybe someone else. All right, so cheetah print is trending this fall. So I dug out this long oversized cheetah print sweater that I got from Target a few years ago. And I'm just wearing this uh, bodysuit underneath. This is, I think this is naked wardrobe bodysuit. And some Sam Edelman loafers. This is so comfortable. If you wanted it a little less oversized, you could probably like cinch it with a belt. So this is what it would look like with some type of belt on the outside of the sweater. And then I just swapped out my shoes for a pair of boots. These are by Jessica Simpson. And I picked them up at the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I think these are so cute giving us an 80s vibe with these scrunched down boots so yeah i'm really liking this this next outfit plays into the denim on denim trend so i'm just wearing this oversized denim shirt from target future collective collection and then these um jeans I'm, i think these are i'm not sure what these jeans are i got them from nordstrom during the anniversary sale i'll put it on the screen but part of the trend is like this cuff this like oversized large cuff and then i'm wearing the red steve madden flats again and a red baseball cap that i got from i think i got this from american eagle and a little red lippy this is christian dior rouge 760 i believe but i just think like the red is still trending and I just like the look of the denim on denim and all of the red accents. I think with all of these color trends, if you don't own any of the like clothing in that particular color, you can accent with your accessories or your makeup. I think that is really cute to do. So like this little outfit, um, of course I can swap the shoes with a pair of tennis shoes if I wanted to, to make it a little more casual. But all of these outfits are just kind of elevated casual maybe. So maybe the red flats are good with it. Then underneath, I just have on a white button down shirt. Please excuse the wrinkles. I just pulled it out of the dryer. So really loving this outfit and it's so comfortable. All of these outfits are comfortable. So it is possible to, you know, have these elevated casual outfits and still be comfortable. This next outfit, I feel like it plays on the preppy trend. So I'm wearing this oversized tweed blazer that I picked up from H&M, a pair of wide leg jeans, and then a pair of brown loafers. These loafers are, I think they're called cork and I picked them up at Nordstrom Rack. And the jeans are part of the most recent Future Collective collection. And then the belt that I paired with this is just this uh, brown Gucci belt that I picked up recently. I was thinking that this could also be worn as like a little short coat in the fall time when it's not too cold. Or in the winter time, you could probably like layer a sweatshirt up under this. But I really like this outfit. Um, this would probably also look cute with these um, AG pants with the little distressing on the hem, but I think I actually like them better with a pair of um, hemmed pants. It just makes it look a little more cleaner and preppy because we're playing into that preppy trend. All right, so those are some of the things that I'll be wearing this fall. I'm super excited. I can't wait for the weather to get a little bit cooler. Let me know in the comments section what you're excited about wearing and some of the items that you purchased or some of the trends that you're participating in or not participating in this year. If you found this video helpful, then please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. And you might be interested in this next video right here. 
If so, then I will see you over there. Bye.